Hello and welcome back to Dot Hack Quarantine. I didn't think this video was gonna get made. I was looking around from my remote to my uh, splitter. I don't think it's called a splitter. My uh... oh, I forget what it is. The device that I use to be able to record old school consoles. Uh, I could not find that remote control. I looked everywhere. I have a bad habit of uh, going in and uh, putting uh, things in my pockets and then into the washer. And so I thought that's what wound up happening. Checked all the pockets to my pants and shorts. Didn't find it. And then I also realized I have a bad habit of just taking things in my hand and leaving them somewhere. And, um, went to go check around on, like, other tables and other rooms and stuff like that. Nowhere to be found either. It's like, well, where the hell could this thing be? And then I remember I realized I, I just recently moved some things around in my room. <clears throat> and I usually will keep this remote on the table. But I move that table and it's not on there. Could it have possibly fallen off of that table and into the trash can underneath? And that's what happened. And I just took out that trash. So I had to go out, find my bag of trash, open it up. And as soon as I look in, there it is right there on the top or on the side. Uh, so it's a good thing I checked and uh, managed to do this before trash day because that would have really sucked not being able to use that device anymore and having to pay to get a remote sent to me. Also, still sick. I don't know if you can really hear my voice. My voice is starting to get better. It's still a little gruff. Uh, I'm still very uh, congested and stuffy, which, I mean, seems like stuffy and congested is a normal tone for myself sometimes. Uh, but it's it's been bad. I've been having issues sleeping, waking up with just a, a terrible, dry, congested throat, chest thing, just hacking and coughing constantly, sleeping with a humidifier, uh, taking hauls, hoping that'll help suppress the cough. The cough is now better than it was this morning when I woke up. I still every once in a while will clear my throat, which I do. You, you hear me, I don't really edit those out. It happens, but I'm doing it more frequently. So I'm, I'm do my best to edit those out when it comes to editing the video, but I make no promises because now I'm also uh, pulling uh, 12 hour shifts for the next three days and would like to get to bed around, oh, this time, right now. That's, that's happening as I'm recording this, 10 o'clock at night. I would really enjoy laying in my bed to get up for work tomorrow, so I'm well rested. But uh, that's not gonna happen. I wanted to record a Die Hack Quarantine video, and I wanted to get it out there since yesterday. I didn't get around to it because I got distracted playing Gundam Breaker 4. So today's the day we get back in to Die Hack Quarantine. Now before we log in though, we had mail. I just came over here because the music wasn't as loud on that menu. So without further ado, let's check my mail. <clears throat> Marlow, Moonstone, Gardenia, and Sanjiro all have things to say. Redbeard 2. It's a movie that celebrates human spirit. It's a bit long, but the ending's a real tearjerker. Well, if there's nothing I like from movies, it's definitely a... Uh, Jerking. Gardenia responds to, I get it. Do the names of the areas you take me to have flower names because you like flowers? Yes. That's basically why. BTW, which stands for by the way. I'm the silent type and usually don't have much to say, but it's strange. For some reason, I seem to talk a lot more when you are around. She likes us. Which is weird, because I'm pretty sure it's like an adult or high school student. 
Moonstone responds to don't worry. Tomorrow I'm sure it'll come out to see you. I hope so. All right, ever the talker that one. Marlo, sorry. I didn't mean it like that. Hey, you're throwing me off. That's okay. Don't worry about it. I just wanted to mess with you. See, I'm a bit twisted. Anyway, don't ever forget to have pure heart, or a pure heart. I've never been one to become attached to anyone. I just don't like all that fake stuff. So just be honest with me, okay? It just makes everything easier and more comfortable. And we can't respond to any of this, either. So these are like the end of their conversations. Which I think for a lot of them is the end. Uh, let's get into the world. Let's go do some missions. We have a lot of missions this time. We're in Act 2 of 3. I got a bunch of missions from the citizens of the net slum that want us to go to different areas and they're kind of high level, but like we have been fighting the guardian from the die hack sign anime and the guardian has been giving us a tremendous amount of experience, which is what the last video I believe was. We went to a named location, found the guardian, just kept beating him up getting the experience and it was me what was it nuke and sandro yeah sandro's at 85 somebody else who's like high level 87 so nuke was with us and wiseman was with us because he's also at 87 and then that got me probably to higher than 87 where am i at right now i'm level 88 ridiculous almost level 100 a lot of my stats look at these 99s everywhere we uh we're amazing got the fallen pope on our head <laughs> all right uh let's go see what some of these missions are let's get to the word list we have a lot of them raging facing mirrors virgin um i don't believe i had to do any virus core hunting Area invited by both Black Rose and Terajima Ryoko. I have a bad feeling about this. Uh, we're high enough level for it. What level are they at? Uh, let's see. Black Rose and Terajima. Black Rose is level 85. Uh, did I pass Terajima? I did. Also 85. Alright, let's just do that. We'll take Terajima. Thank you so very much for inviting me today. Oh, you're so very welcome. And uh, we'll get some Black Rose to join us as well. And I want to say a lot of them are all leveled up. Okay. Or not leveled up, but equipment up. I, I like the higher tiers. Let's check them out. Let's see where they're at. Because uh, it's been a while. It's been a month. I wanted to play in October. Never got around to doing it. Level 85 with an axe. Level 84 with a headpiece. Chest piece 84. Hands at 84. Her leg mail could use an upgrade. Uh, Black Rose with a level 66 heavy blade. That could use an upgrade. 84 on the helm. 84 on the chest. 59 on the hands. That definitely can get upgraded. And then uh, 84 there. Don't know if I can find anything. I may have something. Where do I sit? 98, 98, 98, 98. And then my stealth blades at 49. And the only reason I keep those is for the uh, abilities. But I want to say I do keep around some high level ones. Miracle Twins is 83. And that would boost my stats up even higher. But we keep the certain daggers on us just for specific elemental attacks against other monsters of opposing element all right uh i'm just i'm gonna go check some equipment stuff so i'll be right back and we're back all right so i gave uh, black rose a better weapon she's now has a level 90 weapon i could not find anybody to trade with i think we've traded with about every little npc character that is uh, roaming around in here. So I just wound up buying her a uh, base equipment from the shop for her gloves. Hopefully we will find something 
when we are on the field. Uh, same with Terajima Ryoko, uh, finding something for her while we're on the field. We'll see how that works out. So well, let's get to the area that we need to go to. Over to Raging Facing Mirrors Virgin. <sighs> Rose is coming as well. Yeah, it's a lot easier with more people. Hmm. Ryoko had business here as well? Is that a problem? <laughs> Not really. <sighs> All right, so let's get up. Fairy's orb. Quite a lot of portals around us. Let's go to the first one, see what we get. Oh, these guys. I hate these guys. Your skills. Oh no. Oh no. First aid. Oh, thank goodness. I got. Goddamn charmed. Alright, I think we got the stealth blades on. XP for that. Bunch of silliness. <laughs> All that for nothing. Uh, but there you go. I know how this works. I clear one portal and I go around and clear all the other portals on the map. Here's the thing. If I'm not gonna get a whole lot of XP for beating these monsters, I'm just gonna go right to the dungeon. So, that's what we're gonna go do. So see you in the dungeon. All right, in the dungeon we are. Got a fairy's orb, so we can open this up. Dungeon might be a little different though. I think I'll go around and clear this out. The passage is forked here. I think the ride is the shorter. I'm sorry. But I think it is the left. Um, uh, which way should we go? Well, 
they're both wrong. It's equal. So it doesn't matter which way we go. But there's two chests on the left side. And only one on the right side. So guess what? We're going left. Also, I don't know if they have any strength and abilities, but if they do, cast them. Some darkness resistance. Just kidding, because I don't know what we're facing. Some earthly, uh, bobby gobs. Seven, it's not that great. I feel like the better items that I get now are from data draining, and less from what I actually find in a chest. Jima's way last time, I'm gonna go this way. Because it really doesn't matter which one I chose. i 
a charm, she's just gonna stand there, so that's cool. At least she's not attacking anybody. Oh, because she's also asleep. Not a whole whole lot of experience off that. They are catching. Got more experience from goblins. already over? Third floor, here we come. No, there 
isn't. <laughs> so, which way? Please choose quickly. Uh, okay. Before putting Black Rose to sleep. Classic Black Rose. book collection too. I maxed out on field clears. And I want to say I maxed out on dungeon clears too. A lot of the Ryu book stuff has been completed. And I don't know how much of the game that I'm actually going to go through and like complete. I don't think I'm going to do the item collecting quest. That's just going to be there's like busy stuff to do after you beat the game, so you're still playing the game once it's done. But I think once I beat the story, uh, once I go in and do probably the final Golden Gob tag event, and uh, the hidden boss monster that comes after beating the story, I think I'm done. Unless there's another uh, event, or not event, but like another boss monster area that we go to. In which case, I'll, I'll go and do that one. But then I'm, I'm going to move on. We'll play something else. I don't know when that'll happen. We got three videos a week of Dot .hack, which means tomorrow's also going to be another Dot .hack video. And get back on to the schedule. And then, um... Yeah, what else? Another JRPG, I think. I think I'll just get into another RPG from here. There are plenty of other ones out there. Things that I haven't beaten yet. This was just like a childhood thing of mine to come back and beat. Maybe we'll do that. Maybe I'll pick an old console game that I played as a kid but never beat. I beat Final Fantasy 8 and 7 on PlayStation. Never beat 9 though. Never beat 10 though. Never beat 12. Since 11 was an MMO. I don't know if I can go back and play that and beat it. 
if they let you play it just to do like a, a little story mission. Yeah, I'm just gonna skip the dungeon. We're just gonna get ahead of this. I've actually never beaten Final Fantasy 1 through 6. <laughs> I forgot they remade uh, 5 and 6. Oh boy. Let's see. This time we're going right. No, we should go left. Hey, you! Cut that out! Right is the way to go! What? I won't take this anymore! Tell me why! Why are you coming with us to this dungeon in the first place? Because I'm the one who invited him! Oh, is that true? Uh... So? I was invited by both of you. Uh... Oh, I see. That's what it was. Sorry. Do you think that I should have just chosen one? Who knows? <laughs> I think that you are the only one who can answer that question for yourself. How true. I agree. I think that Black Rose has it exactly right, in my opinion. <sighs> Whatever. I really don't care about it anymore. Maybe we should just go back. Well, I'm going to the right. Mm. And I'm going to the left. Oh, joy. Hey. Oh man, I'm alone. <laughs> I'm going to the right. Okay, they're just gone. Omega Guard, the Golem Parts, Crystal Stone. You now have Subaru's X. Oh, cool. Subaru is uh, from the Die Hack Sign. Movie 97 is added to the desktop. Movie 98 added to the desktop. This is so pathetic. Yeah. All right, little comedy area. Little ha ha between life saving and helping people get out of comas. Gotta have those moments. Uh, let's check out that item though. Curious what that other one was. So there's Subaru's axe, level 80 for heavy axe. Which may be good for Terajima. Giru Rampage. The water two handed attack. God's Punish. An earth two handed attack. And Regim. Which is the uh, recovering SP with time. Uh, the Commandments has it was a Wave Master item this whole time. Oh my god, look at this thing. Omega Guard. Level 99. Crazy for a heavy person. M uh, gain Rom. Level 2 Earth Tornado Magic. And uh, recover SP with time. Another Regime. Alright, well. I'll be definitely giving it that to one of the heavy users. Whoever I happen to add to a party the next time. So that ought to be interesting. I figured it would wind up 
having some weird ending at the end of it. And I'm curious what the movie on the desktop was about, too. I think we should log out, go see if it'll let us see it. Um... Yeah, so you clear the game in order to play these ones here. We have movie 97 and 98 were the ones that we just got, so I guess after we clear the game, we'll have to come back and check it out. Because right now it just lets us do uh, these videos, which was from the last game. It's this one. <laughs> oh, this is just showing the uh, what we did at the end of disc three. All appears to have gone well. Yeah, we're gonna skip past it. I thought it would be something cool. It's not cool at all. So, all this is like with the stuff that you get from the reviews. And it's just essentially all the cutscenes that were in the game. Uh, so there you have it. That's That was that. That was us beating that level. And uh, tomorrow we'll go back, we'll pick another area, we'll go through that area and clear that one as well. We're gonna just zoom on past this. If I could beat this game before the end of this year, that would be great. I feel like it's gonna wind up going into January and then maybe beating it in January. We're on Act 2 and Act 2 is pretty beefy with quite a lot of areas to go to. And um, there's gonna be virus core hunting, but we were doing differently with that where you're not gonna see me do the virus core hunting. I'm not gonna do a video for it. I'm just gonna do that off recording and then we'll go back and you'll just see me go to the areas. It'll be fun times had for everybody. There'll be much rejoicing. Yay. Anyways, thank you all for watching. And I'll see you in the next game of Dot Hack Quarantine. Bye.